Hey everybody, this is Donna Lay from DonnaLay.com and I would like to share with you a little tip that may help extend the life of your favorite tarot pouch. Now, this one happens to come from the Guy and Tarot Limited Edition and I've noticed that many people that have it, um, this little string that's on here, oftentimes when we pull it, it will actually go all the way through and unthread and remove itself from the pouch. So I've seen people walking around without the cover on it and then perhaps doing this to tie it up. You know, and trying to do it like that and then tying it in a bow. But I'm going to show you how to re-thread it and then how to prevent it from coming apart again. And all it takes is something simple around most households and if not it's easy to get. And it's a safety pin. So you just simply put the safety pin through the end of it like that find the opening to the pouch and there it is right there you're just going to put it in it makes it easy then to push it through and if you have a smaller pouch you may just need to use a smaller pin and you just kind of work your way through now I'm having a little bit of a time getting through this middle piece here where it's sealed but I know I can do it because I've done it before there you just got to kind of find your way past the seam all right and you'll see in a matter of maybe a few seconds I am back to the beginning comes out the other side and voila we can remove the pin and it's as good as new now it might be aggravating that it keeps falling through so there's a couple things you can do and what you want to do is take note of the size of the opening and there's lots of things available to you now some things may be free if you happen to be living near the ocean you could use shells because they come automatically sometimes from wear and tear from the waves a little hole so you could tie it to the end of your rope right here just a little knot or any kind of knot double knot that you want and that way it will never be able to fall through again and you can still tie it any way you want want it even to be prettier I happen to like pretty beads and there are beads called Pandora beads and they tend to be very expensive but look you can get kickoffs at places like Walmart, Michaels, AC Moore and what's nice is the hole of the bead is quite large so ribbons can go right through it and you can put a few on if you want to really jazz it up and make it look nice but you just basically put your beads near the end or you can put several of them on you can put um, a little knot around the last one so that the beads won't fall off okay and then let's see I'm just gonna put two beads on this one and then I'll put a double knot on the last one here we have a couple beads on the end and you can see now it won't be able to go back through the hole if I pull it because the bead is too big to make it through there are a lot of stunning beads available today. You can get something like this. It's just an open, looks like an abalone shell. And you could, while it's meant to be threaded this way for string, you can actually just tie it to around the actual circle itself like that. And that will prevent it from going through as well. Okay. And other things that are available that are really beautiful and you can really jazz it up. Take your favorite card, shrink it down put it into the little case because they sell little photo cases now. You can actually open it up if I can figure out the trick here. There we go. And the glass comes out and in between them you put your favorite tarot card clipping or a scan of it and then you can close it again. So if you have a particular favorite card from the deck you can put that there and then just tie that on to the end. Okay. There are lots of other pretty beads. Okay, so you can get little charms. And these are only a couple dollars. Here's another one that could go at the end and you can put again your favorite. You can put your own picture in there. You can put your pet's picture in there, your, your child's picture in there. And of course, on eBay I found a lot of nice things that you can get jade beads and really go crazy. But the trick is just to make sure that the hole in the bead is large enough to accommodate the ribbon. And that's it. And so now, be able to have a nice bow there, and it will have beads at the end. 
And of course you can put some on the other side. You need to look twice as pretty and of course it'll protect both sides of the ribbon. Tarot tip. Have yourself a tarot filled week. Bye now.